Hey, it's Randy Tebert out here on a New Year's Eve day. Out for a ride with my buddy Sam. Just uh, headed out for some breakfast. Headed out the old Beeline Highway. Nice chilly morning here in Arizona. It's about 9.30, 9.45, something like that. Just uh, nice. I don't do a whole lot of riding with people, but uh, I mean, I do, but not usually when I do my videos. So just out here running the running the highway here out to the casino for a decent breakfast and uh, enjoy the company and uh, look at that Sam's new rope glide there which uh, actually was my first sale down at uh, the Harley shop when I was working there so Sam's got his new scooter and it's looking good and I'm on the heritage today obviously you can tell from the big fairing on the front a little cool out today, so a little extra weather protection. So uh, she's doing good as always. This uh, bike, it just every time I ride it, I'm just amazed at the power and the torque. Beautiful morning out here. A little cool, but uh, I think it's probably in the uh, around 50 right now. But uh, I used to have a saying in Colorado when I lived there that if it's 50, we ride problem up there was it'd be 50 at noon and it'd be 31 at 4 o'clock so you know you had to get used to it. Now out here away from the city a little bit it has definitely uh, cooled off so, but this is a great ride. Blue skies a little bit of clouds it's supposed to actually maybe have rain tomorrow so I might not get a New Year's Day ride in but I'll try to do a maybe I'll try to do a, a shop video or a or a talking head video. I don't know. I don't usually do a talking head video, so you know I haven't really tried it. I'm not that pretty, so you know, we'll try it. The holiday weekend traffic's pretty light, this at least this early in the morning. Uh, you know, again the little haze because people are burning fireplaces even though they're not supposed to, but you know, you can't stop. You can't stop people. They do what they do. mine gave me a tour pack uh, a, uh, and I uh, and had to get a rack for it but I haven't put it together yet but I'm gonna have that it's a detachable setup kind of like I had on my old uh, the previous heritage that I owned four years ago or two years ago whatever it was four years ago I think it was and I had a tour pack on there detachable it was pretty nice this is a Viking bags tour pack and I thank you Carl for that and uh, I'm going to be putting that on here sometime soon, you know, and that will allow me uh, some more luggage capability on the, uh, the old Bagger Heritage here, so I say old. It's now coming to a new model year, 2024. It'll be two years old. How about that? Two years old. I, I managed to go over, over a year and a half with, with a, a bike. Amazing, huh? I do like new things. You know, but I'm getting to that point in my life where I'm not going to be able to have that many more new things. You know, you know, who knows how long I got left, and I don't want the bank to take it back when I'm gone. So, you know, hopefully, well, I can, I can uh, have several more, many more good years here on the bike. I'm feeling pretty good still. So, I don't want to think about that. I'm just thinking about today and the gorgeous sights out in front of us but not to the left because that's the landfill, you know. Got to have a place to dump our junk, I suppose. Sometimes it gets pretty ripe out here, especially in the summer. You can really smell the rotting the rotting matter out here. It's not, not all that pleasant, but you're past it in a hurry. They are, they've got it. Uh, burner that burns off the the methane that's in the ground there and you can see it at night this bluish bluish green fire that comes up out of there you can see it for a couple miles coming down the highway here at night I uh, the band uh, that I play in uh, 87 southbound we rehearse up here in uh, the town of Fountain Hills which is up the road here so I make 
take some night trips up this way on rehearsal. And by the way, we had our show, our inaugural show uh, at, a, at a club uh, Friday night at the Rhythm Room. And even though there wasn't a lot of people there, it was a good show. The people that were there had a good time. And uh, we performed well, and it was good. It was fun. I liked it. I liked it, and uh, the, the crowd liked it. attention and we went around a truck on the side of the road that was running and the light was flashing so I figured uh, anyway you know you ride you know Red Mountain looking good this morning just a great day to be out uh, leather weather here in Arizona you know 50 degrees is still 50 degrees and uh, I would say 50 degrees in Colorado felt warmer than 50 degrees does here in Arizona. So I don't know what it is, but we're so used to warm temperatures. I mean, yesterday it was in the 70s, and uh, today it's only supposed to be about 63. So it's all right, 63 is pretty nice. But uh, I don't need any heated gloves or heated grips or anything right now. You know, I, I don't do that much riding at night anymore when it really gets chilly, but. Yeah, life's changed, things change, tastes change, you know, I've changed. So, anyway. Randy T. Bird out here in nice cool Arizona on the last day of 2023 and uh, watch the tourists here anyway if you haven't subscribed please do I always appreciate everybody that subscribes we're moving along these days and it's uh, looking good I think it was 1115 as of yesterday awesome thank you new subscribers I sure appreciate it and I appreciate you watching my videos and you all have a happy, safe new year, and we will talk to you again soon.